Alrighty, who's ready to go fishing? As you can tell by the name of the video, we're going to be getting rich, selling fish today in Red Dead Online. You might be thinking to yourself, real quick, you're crazy. How can you have over a thousand hours played? How can you be a level 362 and you're giving advice to go fishing to make money? Well, I'm going to tell you guys why right now. Okay, so this month, it's under the benefits, this month we have three times money on fish sales and more. Sell your catch of the day to the butcher with three times money on fish sales. Additionally, reel in bluegills, catfish, salmon, and more in the fishing challenge free roam event to earn double money and XP through February 5th. Today we're just going to focus on the top. We're going to go over three fishing spots today and see how much we can make. Stick around to the end to see how much we make at each from each location, we're gonna break it down from each location, how much we made, and we're gonna take the same amount of time at each one so we can keep it fair. But for the first location, we're gonna to go to, I want to try to cover the covers, cover the corners of the map, more or less. So the first one's all the way here at the end of New Austin, that's the San Luis River. I don't think I've ever really fished there before, we're close there, um, so. I'll see you guys when we're at the spot. Alright guys, we're arriving at the first location. San Luis River. Let's see what we can do here. We ran over a bird. Won't be flying anywhere soon. Right. Get the rod out. Will you do something, you coward? So I'd recommend, it says, you know, it's a river, so you can use the river lure, you can use any of the baits that'll catch them, but honestly, just get the special spinner. You'll catch, you'll be able to catch anything, it won't break, I mean, if it breaks, it, it doesn't technically break. Like, I don't know what also, you're saying. Change the setting to reel it in with square. It feels slow at first while you're doing it, but once it actually hooks the fish, this is the, it's the best way. It's almost no fail anytime. Hi. Okay. You see, you're just holding square the whole time. You're just up down. Our fe first catch of the day. Nobody cares. Is a one pound, fourteen ounce bluegill. I just threw it back. Damn, fool. <laughs> Don't want to talk about that one. So we just, <laughs> the first catch of the day, we threw it back. Maybe lay off the liquor for a while, huh, feller? So what I want to do is I want to get at least 10 fish at each of the spots. And we'll do our sales individually, and you'll see that broken down at the end. So that's our first one. It's bluegill again. Well, that's something. Or put a deer carcass, the good old days, or put a deer carcass right by the end of the water and let the fish run up. I don't see why Got not. Rock bass. For the second. Try to get something big. I want a big fish. Stick around to the end though, because I believe the third spot we're going to is going to be the best for multiple reasons, and I'll explain why when we get there. We got a meeting to get to. Get back up there. Let me know in the comments how do you guys feel about Red Dead 2024? You guys think they're gonna do anything to it? You think they're finally gonna realize they shouldn't leave us in the dust? Or they just really don't care, Rockstar? I'm thinking, I, I don't know. I think they will add stuff this year, but I'm not getting my hopes up. I had a plan. I still have a plan. That was a rock bass as well, I'm pretty sure.
But as you can see with this, it, it makes it so easy and seamless. You don't even have to be good at this fishing. You just up, down, up, down, up square. I don't What's know up? what you're saying. How many fish we got so far? All right, we got four. We got a meeting to get to. Get back up there. Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh God! No point giving you money. You'll just drink it away. You're, you're an idiot! We have beautiful sunlight. I like this spot. I don't think I've ever been here. In these times, that's good to hear. Okay, so you can't... <laughs> it's not just that easy. You gotta kind of control it. This ain't going so well! It's better than doing it on your own and turning the wheel, spinning R3 multiple times. I don't know what you're saying. Yeah, here. Now this will be sped up, so you can, you guys will see me catch them really fast. The point of this is mostly to show you guys how we can make this money. We'll be here when you get back. Hurry up, please! You're falling behind! I'm sorry, okay? I'm sorry, but I, I want us to get out of here. You're drunk, cowpoke. Have another drink, Morgan. You want me to just shoot you and be done with it? Let's go, you son of a bitch! Alright, it just started raining. We need two more fish in this spot. I don't want to get too wet though, you know. Got a long way back home. Plus, we still got two more fishing spots. The mud here will bury you, friend. I want to know in the comments what is your guys' favorite fishing spot if you have one? Or if you've even been fishing in this game. What? Yeah, that's a dumb question. Bro, what are you talking about, man? I don't know, man. I used to play with some people, they never would fish. Our last one of the spot. Nobody cares. The biggest one we've gotten so far. What is that? All right, five pound steelhead trout for the last uh, last little catch of this spot. That's perfect. Sometimes called the rainbow trout. This tasty catch is a top prize among anglers who often use worms as bait. All right. You know, you seem real perceptive for a blind man. Alright guys, got our first 10, now our next spot is over, no we're going to do that last because that's the best one I think, we're going to go to what's supposed to be the fish spot, Legrasse. Alright, we're at Legrasse. Unlike most of you whiners, I've been in some real um, tight we're spots. Fish just like right here. 
at the actual dock. Yeah, we're gonna go on the actual dock here. And this ain't even a goddamn spot, let alone a tight one. All right. Ten fish. Here we go. The bayou. The moon. The grass. Will you do something, you coward? First catch at the grass. Bluegill. Once again. I've seen a lot of bluegills. It's the biggest piece of dog shit. I've seen a whole lot of bluegills. Well, duh. But just wait till we get to the last spot. Don't know what you're getting at. Here we go. What we got here? Another bluegill? Yep. Now what I could do, and I'll probably come out with another video with more of a exploit probably. Where we're trying to run the fish out of the shore. He fucking cheated! For the first one. For this, we need to just keep it as it's supposed to be. Keep it fishing, see how much we can make just on the side, turn on some music, put on a movie and just fish. Why the hell not? Alright, come on. We got here a bluegill. <laughs> I haven't seen one of them before. Not funny, I know. Maybe lay off the liquor That's for a while, huh, fella? Oh, look at the water. Getting a little more action out here. I mean, is that four? Another bluegill. <laughs> this is the spot for bluegills. What's this? This is number five. Bullhead catfish. We haven't had. We haven't gotten that yet, have we? I'll give you a hint, though. For the next one, we're most likely gonna have to pull out the the hunting wagon. Look at the long fin that's hanging out of the water down there. What the hell? Is this seven? That was wishful thinking putting that. Shit real. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Our third catch of this spot. It's a big and 14 pound four and four ounce lake surgeon. Okay. Okay. We gotta get to our horse. Head off to the third spot. You might owe her something fancy, friend. Put this on the bag, and I will see you guys at the third and final fishing spot. And I think it's probably going to be the best. That's going to be over here at Blackwater, right by the butcher, so we can sell the fish. And we should be able to get a lot of long goose gnar here. Oh, I didn't screenshot from where we got. Okay, so here we go. Okay. We are at the third and final spot. And I think. No, it's over here. I think I'm going to call my lake. Iron Lake and Blackwater.
first catch at best. It's the biggest piece of dog shit. Yeah, look at this pool peeling up. Hopefully I don't have to cast. <laughs> I was gonna say, hopefully I don't have to cast too far. We gotta cast a little further than that. Well, duh. Paul giving you money, you'll just drink it away. Number three, boot then. Or is that a rock bass? That's a rock bass. Here. Oh, come on. <laughs> come on, let me catch it up right here. Pull it in immediately. <laughs> yeah. Number four. So we called our wagon, but <laughs> looks like we're not gonna need it. Number five. The spot is much quicker, though. I will say that. This is the spot. Because, I mean, a lot of times you get a whole pool full of long goose gnar, like the big fish. Yeah. Number six. I keep holding R2 to um, reel it in, but I don't need to. <laughs> yeah, so you... Um, you want to aim it at that rock over there in this spot. That way you can reel it in pretty much immediately. Without worrying about the aggressiveness. By the time it snaps, you already have it. See? Yeah. Seven. Got two more. Nice. And uh, I think that would be rank number two. The grass was taking a while. And that's supposed to be like the spot. So in Blackwater, this one, this one's the quickest. And I'm right there next to the butcher. So if we were to get the long goose, we can just sell. Go right back. This is number 10. Number, yeah, number 10. Chain pickle. Alright. So. This took us about 30 minutes. 12 rock bass. 2 red fin pickles. 9 bluegills. 1 bullhead catfish. One steelhead trout, four pickerels, chain pickerel, I should say, and we have one lake sturgeon. Let's go ahead and see what the butcher got for us. Howdy, friend. How can I help you? Yeah, howdy, friend. All right, fifty thousand six hundred and eleven and fifty-eight cents is the number. These two redfin pickerels going for six bucks. <laughs> Seems I buy this near every Blue day. Bluegills, they're going for 225 a pop. For nine of them, we're getting 20. Pretty standard fare these days. For the rock, for the rock bass, we're getting three a piece. So for 12 of them, we're getting 36. Seems I buy Bullhead this catfish, near every 225. Day. Chain pickerels are going for three apiece, so for four of them we're getting twelve. 
Pretty standard fare these days. Steelhead trout is going for seven fifty a piece. And the lake sturgeon is going year, for twenty one dollars and seventy five cents a piece. All right, that's it. We had fifty thousand six hundred and eleven. Now we have fifty thousand seven hundred and seventeen. So in thirty minutes, we made a hundred and fourteen bucks. Not too bad, not too bad at all, actually. I, uh, I think that's a good method. I think it's a great method if you just are trying to chill. Um, I mean, there's definitely better ways to make money, but that's just, that's a nice chill way to make money. Fun, sure, but my purse is hurting. I want to know in the comments if you guys enjoyed this, what kind of spots do you like to fish at? And, uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm your boy Lil Crook TV. This is how you get rich selling fish in Red Dead Online this month. I'll see you guys next time. Peace. Nobody cares!